Good afternoon. Uh, today I would like to talk about masks because um, right now th there is a whole misunderstanding of why do we have to wear masks. Uh, first, a lot of people think that masks wearing a mask is to protect themselves from the virus and that's why they argue about it and say well we were told that um, the mask will not protect you um, so so this is really the main argument and second is that people think that it's kind of p political uh, debate or political uh, uh, competition that this group is telling this group to wear masks so uh, they are saying no I'm not gonna follow what this group is saying which is not true um, and then the third one, people say, this is, which it's related to the first one. They say, this is my body and, and I don't care whether I catch the, ma and the virus or not. Um, again, I think, and, and I'm not a doctor, I'm an accountant, so, uh, I, but I've read a lot and I know a lot about a lot of, medical issues because um, when my mom was alive she's been through a lot so I've read about a lot of cases and things and she actually passed from the flu in 2018 she was in the ICU for four weeks and she had all the symptoms that the the this virus caused respiratory Tory problem, get on the ventilator, she ended up with sepsis, lactic acid was elevated, oxygen was down, that gives the body the best environment to have bacteria and viruses multiplying, so your whole body gets uh, saturated with, with infections, that's what the sepsis, and, and then everything shuts down, and the worst thing when you start have, uh, having the bowel uh, system, the bowel movement stopping because your colon doesn't work like those muscles. Anyway, so that, that just to give you an idea about what I've been through and I've seen. When she was in the hospital, every day when I went there, I had to wear a mask to get close to her. I knew from day one that this was not to protect me from what she got. It's to protect her if I have something because she doesn't need more. She's very weak. She's very vulnerable. She's very, like, she, she can't really take more infections or anything. Same thing when, when you walk into any uh, ICU uh, to see someone who just got out of a surgery, especially like a very uh, sensitive surgery and very complicated, like open heart surgery, because she had open heart surgery years ago. And same thing, we had to wear masks to get it because this is to protect her, not us. So to wear a mask is to protect others from what you might have. This is the, the simplest thing. So of course, if you're kind of like selfish and you don't care about what others uh, might get from you, this is, this is really a problem. But if you keep on saying, 
I'm not going to wear a mask because I myself don't care if I get it. That, that means you're missing your point. You're missing the whole point of wearing the mask. So wearing the mask is to protect others from what you might have. This is the bottom line. And if you say, this is my body, but n no, because your um, act affects others. And if you have something, maybe you spread it to other people. And if this is not taken serious, we will be in the shutdown forever. This need, needs to be taken more serious than what it is. And wearing a mask is not really the, the, the only or, or the best thing. No, we need to have more things going on along with wearing masks. Because shutting down certain areas and certain uh, places like bars, clubs, whatever, like here in Jacksonville, it's only hurting those people econ like econom economically. But it doesn't really prevent the virus. We need, we need better way and more things to do. To protect people from the virus, and also we need more things to do to protect those people economically. So we need better actions, we need better management, and also we need to have better conscience because each one of us is responsible for what he does to others.